Package in the mail, MSX games from Japan. Collecting without fail, those shoot 'em ups, and that's the plan. He doesn't just collect them, he also codes them too. Join us and we'll go on electric adventures with you. Hey YouTube, Electric Adventures here with a little package in the mail. Uh, from a local seller. It's very unusual to see something for this system here in Australia. Um, and it's actually, I haven't had a title for this system for a while. Um, I do have a few titles though, so there are only so many that I'm, um, they're actually on my list of ones that I would like to get. Sorry, it's actually sticky taped up very well. Um, so it is none other than the um, so it's a Japanese system, it's none other than the PC Engine, but also it's a PC Engine CD title. Um, and one I haven't actually seen a copy um, for sale even in Japan in my travels, and I didn't actually realise there was a version uh, for the system. So PC Engine CD, um, I actually I have a lot more of the Hue card games for the PC Engine, not many CD ones. And this is one of my favourite games that I used to play for my Atari ST back in the day. The version of it on the Atari ST was great fun. Um, I played it, my wife played it. Um, I believe there's a really good version on the uh, Mega Drive. Um, there is a version on the Mars system, its version's okay. There's a version on the NES and Famicom, and they're okay. They're not quite the same as the arcade game. And there's also a really good arcade perfect version on the... Um, uh, Sega Saturn, and it's none other than Rainbow Islands. So I had no idea there was a PC Engine version. So I'm actually looking forward to seeing what it's like. Now they've, um, the person's got it in an, a plastic case. It's just a soft plastic case, so I'll take that off so you can see the cover a bit better. Looks in pretty good condition. No spying card or anything, but I really don't care about those. Uh, but we have the manual and the CD. And the CD's not too bad, so um, yeah. Single game, we can have a decent gameplay. Hopefully I won't be too bad, because I used to play it a bit on the Atari SC. I've never played the arcade game though, so I have to see what the difficulty level's like. Alright, so let's go do that now. Right, so here we go with uh, Rainbow Islands. Um, I am using an arcade stick, we'll see how we go. Don't know whether a controller would be better. I'm just going to. Uh, menus in Japanese, so. the options. Here we go. So you've got your worlds and your intermission scenes which is also good. Right, so I've got all that. We have our... Yeah, so basically we have this too and we can create rainbows. Our shoes. So these stars basically kill everything in the range, and then you collect gems, which you collect a set of those. So now I've got double rainbows now. If you take too long, the water comes up. So it's the end of the first day. Collect all the bonuses. And we go to round two. Now there's like four stages and then you get a boss. I do ship. Collect as many um
collect as many blocks, as many things as you can as you go. And the more things you can get at once, than one thing is the more bonus you get. So I've got quite a few. things at once then. And as you can see you can use your rainbows to um whoops. <coughs> Usually it's best getting to the top when you're getting the hurry up. Not sure whether you touch the chest to take it to the next level, depends on the version of the game. But this is a pretty solid version. It's probably flickering more than I would have thought it would have. Oh, shoes again. fall all the way down to the bottom. So you can use the falling rainbow rainbows to actually pick up things that are below. Oh bugger. I'm gonna jump in. Ah, and that was another potion. I'll not do it round through without losing a life, considering this is my first game of this version. Ah, oh, we lose everything. Okay. It's a bit mean. And we fell right down, so. Ah! This is a little hard when you lose both your shoes, which is your speed, and your rainbows. No, I missed you. Oh, God am I. Right, I'll just fall and mess up. I would have missed that pickup now. Oh god. And as you can see the water's coming to get me. I'm not gonna excuse the controls either because this is just me being out of practice. Finally made it. We need those shoes. Ah, oh, no, I didn't make it. Oh. Need those shoes to get faster. So it's got nice music, and it's got a, you know, it's a, it's a it's a platformer that I like. Yeah, we're just gonna have to exit. Ah, oh, dear. I'm gonna have to hope I get some of the um the power ups in the next level. I want to be able to get to the boss to see you. I'll just show you as well. So at the end of each world, you have a boss. Oh god, I almost died then. Want those shoes. Right, I hope that's giving me double. Oh, I touched him! Oops, I was doing so well too. Making a comeback. Right, let's 
самом. Covering. Right. That should give us three rainbows again. Right. This is the boss. <laughs> I've never played the boss on this game before, so I'm gonna die. No, he's gonna get me. I reckon I've had a lives too, aren't I? No, oh, I was enjoying myself. Um. A very solid version. I am very pleased to um, have picked this up. Very good sound too. No continues, bugger. Maybe that's an option in the menu. But um, a very solid version of Rainbow Islands. Sorry, I'm a little out of practice. Um, I'm just seeing. So we actually have seven worlds too, which is which is quite impressive. So um, oh, look, I'm enjoying myself. So I'm gonna kick up. Oh. And then I make a stupid mistake to start with. Oh dear. Shoes! Oh, okay. And a potion. I've definitely never game, it's too much fun. I like it. So I mean I know I generally do prefer, you know, play lots of shoot 'em ups and things like that, but I do enjoy a good, well balanced platformer. one gym. Not sure what getting the full set of gems gives you. In a while. Oh, completed. Ah. 
Steam. in the back thing. Now we just need to get through this without losing them all. first lot. big spikes and um Any more practice. Alright, as you can see, it's a good fun game. I'm definitely going to get some very good gameplay out of it and enjoy it very much. So, I'm Electric Adventures. Thanks to all my subscribers. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.